There are plenty of ways to jazz up your yard, from plants and trees to questionable lawn decor. But I think one of the best and most versatile is sometimes the most overlooked, and that's lighting. And when you can add smarts to the lighting so that your lights change colors and improve your safety and security overall, all the better. One of the newest ones to cross my threshold is the Govi Triad Floodlight. In this review, I'll try the light out here in my yard. I'll talk about the assembly and the setup process here as well as the installation. I'll touch on brightness and special features and then I'll wrap things up with the pros and the cons and let you know if I think I can recommend this large format outdoor light for you. What are you getting here? The Govi Outdoor Triad Floodlight is a plug-in floodlight. It's kind of a souped up version of the original Govi Floodlight, which comes in packs of two, four, or six individual lights. With this one though, you're getting a triple light as a single unit. There is a big bright floodlight in the middle flanked by two identical ones on either side attached by strong hinges. Inside the box, you get the floodlight along with a pair of ground stakes and a hex key to adjust the light. You also get a power adapter and control box, which connects it to a power source. This light is probably bigger than you're expecting, and you can actually see that here. It is quite tall with the stakes included and very wide, and that's going to mean that it can illuminate much larger areas than some other smart lighting options. Let's talk setup and installation. These floodlights aren't your average lights. Govi Outdoor Triad floodlights feel heavy and built kind of like a tank. The body is made of aluminum where the original was plastic and these hinges feel rock solid. To adjust the left and the right panels horizontally, you'll want to loosen the hinge using the included hex key and then retighten to lock them to your preferred position. The light's supposed to be able to operate in temperatures from minus four Fahrenheit to 113 Fahrenheit or minus 20 Celsius up to 45 degrees Celsius, and they are IP66 weather resistant. Now I'm installing this during the summer season here in Calgary, so I won't be able to evaluate yet what harsher winter weather and snow does to them. I'll have to follow that up after a season or two. Assembly here is easy. Just insert the top screw part of the stake into one of the holes in the light's frame. Then take the butterfly nut and tighten the screw to secure the stake into place. Repeat those steps with the other stake. Then to place the light, just push the stakes firmly into the ground. Now, if you don't mind a bit of extra work, you could wall mount these lights as well. With the light in position, you'll want to adjust the angle of the side lights using the hex key. Next, it's time to get them connected to your phone for remote control and the fun stuff. Setting up and pairing Govi lights to your phone takes just a minute. Just go into the app and choose to add a light and your triad floodlight should appear in the list. It takes just a couple taps to connect it and then you're ready to go as I was during my own installation. You can adjust the color settings of each individual light panel so you can create a cool gradient like rainbow effect when you spread out the side lights or have every light show the same color. If you don't want to get fancy, you can just use warmer or cooler tones of white light too, which is ideal for security. And it goes without saying the brightness is fully adjustable using the slider bar in the app. The scene section of the app lets you choose over 40 lighting presets and more fun effects, which can apply to all three lights. You can also configure the lights to respond to music with the music sync feature too, if you've got a speaker in your yard. Now, right out of the gate, these lights are surprisingly bright. With 4,500 lumens, you can really fill a large area with light, especially when you make those horizontal adjustments. Now, depending on where you install them and how you aim the lights, these can cover a really wide area and they can be both extremely bright, making them ideal for security, or you can just dim them down to provide more of a relaxed ambient glow. You can easily move the location of the lights by simply pulling up the stakes and adjusting it, but I did find it a bit more annoying to have to go searching for the hex key anytime I wanted to adjust the angle of the light. I would love to see a better system, maybe some type of flexible locking mechanism, so a tool isn't always required if you want to make some changes. One of the things I really love about Govi lights is the ease of scheduling. I got these lights set up inside the app to come on automatically in the evening and then turn off in the morning. You can also adjust what color the lights will stay or just make instant adjustments in the app. Overall, I think this light is fantastic and it solves a lighting pain point that many people have. Let's go over the pros and the cons. 
On the pro side, you're getting a large, bright, and powerful floodlight. It's easy to set up and easy to install like all Govi lights. As an outdoor rated light, it should be able to withstand all kinds of weather, and I can say my other Govi outdoor lights are quite durable. It's fun to play with Govi preset lighting effects or choose your own colors, and with an easy to use app for scheduling and personalization and the ability to use voice control, this light has been a fantastic choice. So what are the downsides? I think the biggest detriment to this light is going to be needing a tool to adjust the angle. Too often those tools end up disappearing after you've installed it, making it harder to make adjustments down the road. I would love to see a redesign with maybe a flexible mechanism that doesn't require a tool if there's going to be a future version. But otherwise, if you're looking for a great outdoor light, make sure you add the Govi Triad Outdoor Floodlight to your shortlist. The price ranges from about 129 US to 219 Canadian, and yes, that is another massive gulf in price from Yankee to Connect. And if this light doesn't quite fit your outdoor lighting needs, I've reviewed so many different options from both Govi and other brands. Make sure to check out those reviews right now.